No prizes for guessing that I really, really love Miss Earth. Welcome to Sugar Spice Nice. My name is Shweta and in this video I am in Nasik's most famous place for Misard. Everybody told me I have to come here at Sadhana Suliwarsi Misard. This is one of the most popular Misard places in Nasik and from what I hear they've turned this into a real experience. So let's head inside and see what this place is all about. My family and I drove down here and the good thing is that they have ample parking. Starting with the scene outside, this place is super busy and lively. So you can do all of these rides. There's a camel, there are horses and there's also a bullock cart ride. And you have to go there at the ticket counter, buy your coupon and then you can enjoy your ride. So now this behind me is the entry to the food part, the restaurant sitting part. So let's just go inside and explore. This is the misal at Sadhana Chuliwarchi misal and this is how they serve it. We've just ordered a classic misal. Essentially a dish made of sprouts topped with lots of farsan, save, even add more onion to it. Just given it uh, relatively a little bit more dry because you can select the rasa that you want in it. By rasa, I mean gravy. Tada rasa, tikhat rasa. You add this to this, top it with some onion, top it with some lime, and enjoy it with pao. Pao's are huge, so they are lightly toasted, you can see from the texture. And I think this is dahi, I'm not sure, but let's just make the misal first. I'm going to mix both because I'm scared how spicy it might be. The taste is so good. The crunchiness of the save from the onion is what is giving it that nice texture. Tikha rasa, spicy gravy, kind of hits you later. I'm glad I mixed up the two because otherwise this would have been really, really fiery. So we ordered an extra pao and uh, this one looks freshly buttered. You can see that butter wala glaze. I also wanted to try their bhakri. They've given the bhakri with some thetsa. This is the traditional mirchi thetsa spicy. It's so nice and warm. I think Thetsa, Bhakri and Dahi. Sorted. This is Chuli Varchi ice cream. They describe it as made with milk, boiled on chula and processed in traditional wooden pot. So maybe it might feel a little bit like kulfi. I'm not sure. But let's try it. They told me it's Mawa Malai ice cream. So there's like a little bit of dry fruit inside, cashews and stuff. It is super creamy. It's probably the crispiest jalebi I've eaten. You can hear the sound of every bite. And good jalebi does feel a little different. One thing that's super duper interesting at Sadhana Chuli Varchi Misal is the way they put the misal and stuff together. This is the Chuli Varchi Misal pot and you can see in what a big kadai stuff is happening. And here is the misal. Probably the biggest misal pot I've ever seen. Let me know if you guys have seen a bigger one. These are all the things that are needed for the assembly of the missile and here is where all of this fine, fast chopping takes place. This is the missile assembly place. You can see these katoris of missile are ready and watching them getting assembled in a plate and being served is so satisfying. Nine plates of missile here. Oh my god. That's the 10th plate. He's got them all 
and they're going to be delivered to the tables now. The pavs here are roasted with pure cow ghee and not butter. They're not overdone, just a little bit. Wow! They collect them in like this wide tray. This is the lassi here and uh, it is looking super super thick and creamy. Probably you won't be able to drink it, you'll have to eat it. Look at that thickness. These are the good jalebis that are super popular here. Jalebis being fried in asli cow ghee. They are not dunked in regular sugar syrup. This is the good ka chashni. Oh wow. Fresh, fresh, fresh jalebis. I kept thinking this is Jawari Chi Bhakri, but actually it's not. It is Bajra Bhakri. Making Bajra Bhakri is an art. This well has water and you can actually draw water and I don't think I've ever done something like this in my life. Filled a pail of water. Everybody be eating all fancy fire pan and with like different smoke coming out and I'm just sticking to my regular meetha pan. So that is really it from my visit to Sadhna Tsulivarji Misal. I really like the feel of the place. What I like is that there's one star item in the menu and all of the accompaniments kind of revolve around it and are complimentary to it. Everybody can come and try and have that stellar experience. I also like the feel of the place. They've tried to keep it as simple as possible but uh, still giving it a little vibe. I love the comfy seating. I love the way the whole operations takes place. I mean, that assembling of misal, the making of jalebi, the ice cream, everything is just top notch. So, is this place overrated? No. Is this a must visit in Nasik? Yes, I highly recommend. I'm gonna leave all of the details and stuff of this place in the description box below. So, make sure you check that. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for more videos from me. I'll see you in my next one. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Share it with all of your friends and family and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.